Just hours after the iPhone 5 went on sale worldwide, Kevin Keller and Wayne Lom at IHS iSupply were busy taking the phones apart to see what's inside. Well, we've done a complete uh, teardown disassembly of the iPhone 5. A couple takeaways, one of them is, uh, notice the enclosure is now a single piece of uh, what we call unibody aluminum, hogged out of a single piece, similar to the uh, iPad and the MacBooks. So a technology now being incorporated into the uh, iPhone uh, products. Uh, notice the battery uh, at first glance looks to, to be a bit larger than the old iPhone 4S, but in fact, it's actually thinner as well. So they flatten it out in order to uh, uh, help achieve the uh, thinner product. Uh, the display, uh, as has been reported, uh, incorporates a new technology called uh, in-cell touch. Rather than having a uh, overlay touch screen element over the display, it's now integrated into the display itself, resulting in a thinner display. So inside the iPhone 5, we see that the um, printed circuit board has been updated. Uh, namely, the main processor, application processor, is updated to A6 processor. Um, that is going to be uh, provide a much faster and fluid um, user experience for the iPhone 5 users. Also, this is the first time that we've seen Apple include an LTE baseband, an LTE-capable um, radio in an iPhone. And this uh, new design allows it to not only work in the U.S., but also globally. Our preliminary estimate for the total component cost in the iPhone 5 is about $197. This compares to about $188 for the iPhone 4S. Cost increase due primarily to the new uh, A6 processor, the uh, in-cell touch display, and the more advanced LTE radio.